Hi everybody, it's Rich here at Henderson's Lineup and we are starting a brand new series called The Voice of the Customer. The Voice of the Customer. And I'm joined by a great customer. Sean and his wife are here with their brand new Outlaw by Thor. And it's a 2023 and you might be saying, why would you bring a brand new coach into the shop? You just got the darn thing. So tell us a little bit about where you came from and why did you bring a brand new coach into Henderson's lineup? Well, we came from Washington State down here to Grants Pass to have our rig work done because we picked it up brand new just about a month or two ago uh, from about six hours from home. And on the way home, it scared us to death on the wandering and the blowing around on the road. Uh, and so I started doing some research and, and came across some YouTube videos and some other um, Facebook information about uh, people who were referring others to Henderson's. And so I started digging in a little bit. And then I was ultimately referred here by an alignment specialist in my hometown that works on semi trucks. So they heard that I had the F53 chassis and uh, said right, right away, said, oh, I know, say no more. I know what you're dealing with. You need to call Henderson's. So here I am. And um, we've had some work done on the chassis and it's, um, it's been awesome so far. What kind of aftermarket parts did you put on? I think I've, I saw radius rods. Yep, we got radius rods. Okay. We've got track bars. Oh, we in, changed in, some bushings. in the back. In the back, yep. yep. We changed the uh, bushings, I think, in the anti-sway bars, which are upgraded on this chassis. We have the new upgraded F53 chassis, which has yep. the bigger sway bars, which is great. One of the biggest changes also is we have the new Coney shocks um, on the rig, and that was probably something I noticed more. Oh, and also we had a safety steer put on at the dealership, oh, okay. but it wasn't adjusted correctly. So um, now it's adjusted correctly, and that between that and the shocks, and I suppose everything put together, it was immediately noticeable when I drove it after the, after the... Yeah, I was just going to say, so we, one of the things we do here is, is called the Road Performance Assessment, RPA, where we take your coach out on a drive test. The last thing we like to do is, is, is throw parts on a motorhome. We really want to solve problems. And so what was the biggest difference between the first drive and then after everything was put on and the second drive? What were the biggest things you noticed? Um, yeah, that was nice that we did that before and after drive uh, because we were able to really tell the difference. So when I got behind the wheel um, on the after drive, right away I noticed that the wheel was centering itself as I, as I took off even from the shoulder. Okay. We were going over some back roads here that were really pretty wavy and bumpy. Yeah. And um, I didn't notice any checking back to side, you know, front to back. Okay. Um, and as we, even as we pulled in and out of the, the parking lots where you get the big, you know, the big roll, Sway. Um, that was even oh, reduced yeah. and it was just great. Awesome, so big difference. So so your wife's gonna be happy. You don't have to sell it, sounds like. <laughs> don't have to sell it, <laughs> okay, that's <good>. right. <laughs> Oof. All right, well, we always say, you know, the customer is the best part of our business. If we didn't have you, we wouldn't have a business. And so some people watch these videos on YouTube and they're literally asking themselves, is it worth it to come in and take my, you know, take my rig into Henderson's lineup? What advice would you give that person watching this video and they're kind of on the fence. When, when everything's considered, the, the cost is not that great. The financial cost to come here is not super high. And the guys will help you pick and choose. If you have a specific issue, um, you don't have to do the whole, every product in the book type of a fix. And, right. and as a matter of fact, they almost tried to talk me out of doing that, but I just said, hey, I'm here. I want to do as much stuff as you can. And um, it still wasn't super expensive. And so um, they even have it, you guys would even have accommodated us staying in the rig at night. We yep. stayed at a hotel luckily, locally, and you know, and made a little vacation out of it. but. Um, it could be really simple. You come here, stay in your rig at night, and um, get the work done by day. And yeah. um, and I, I just it's a it's a really you guys made it really easy for me to to get it set up and, and make it happen. That's good. Just last thing I really want to point out is you're the first person in the world to have the brand new Coney shocks, mm -hmm. Evo shocks. I mean, how do you feel, how does that feel? Like you're the guy. I love being the guy. That's all right. <laughs> So that's so, good. Uh, yeah, and they, they work. I mean, right away we noticed that difference. It was amazing. Yeah. Awesome. awesome. I, and, and honestly, speaking of shocks, I was first, when I first talked about shocks, I thought, you know, gosh, guys, these are brand new shocks. This, this rig has 2,000 miles on it. Yeah. Um, why would I want to change my shocks? I mean, I understand the other parts about the track bars and the, you know, but the shocks, I'm like, well, they're brand new. Well, once we drove the rig before and after, and I yeah. saw exactly what the shocks were not controlling originally. The, the new shocks are, uh, you know, they're slammed up. Yeah, that's a really good point because because they are brand new, but they're not high performance mm -hmm. shocks. Right. And and you know you get what you pay for, and mm -hmm. so it's it's smart of you to upgrade it. And you're the one on the road, and mm -hmm. if you're not comfortable, if you're white knuckling it, that's not that's not a good experience. It's not fun. Yeah. And if Mama ain't happy, nobody's happy. So <laughs> we got to make sure we take care of Mama, right? That's for sure. All right. Well, thank yep. you, Sean. Appreciate the, right, the comment. Thank yeah. you guys for watching. If you got value from this, please hit the like button and subscribe so that you're updated when new videos are uploaded. And until we see you in another video or on the road, we wish you safer and happier driving. Drive safe, have fun! Mr. Henderson, <laughs> I would not have been here except for Rich's handiwork. I mean, that video just really sold me. <laughs> there you go. If I get a bonus, I'll split it. Uh, there you go. <laughs>